Heart health is an ongoing concern for everyone. It should be. Heart attacks impact all genders, not just the frequent perception that maybe men are more affected. February is heart month, so the American Heart Association reports about 53,000 women die from heart attacks each year. So joining us to talk about heart attack symptoms, which can be different for female patients, is Dr. George Hosh, cardiologist with Unity Point Clinic Cardiology in Cedar Rapids. Thanks for making time for us today. Well, we appreciate it. So, so what are these differences in symptoms between men and women regarding heart attacks, doctor? Um, most of the time, heart attack is thought about when people have crushing pain in their chest, uh, sometimes radiating in their shoulders mm -hmm. uh, or neck. But women can have different symptoms, especially younger women. They can have um, neck pressure without chest pain. They can have shortness of breath. They can have uh, nausea or sweating, back pain sometimes. So sometimes we call them atypical symptoms, which are symptoms that are not very well known by um, the population, but they can indicate heart attack in women more frequently than uh, than even some providers can think. I think of some of the prevention methods just for myself as, as a male who's 41 years old. Try not to be too stressed out. Try to eat right. Try to exercise. Uh, what, what are some of the risk factors and maybe some of the things that, that women can do to also try to lower their risk of heart attacks? You know, we know that, uh, uh, we know that women have uh, a lower chance of heart attack as they are younger because they are protected. After menopause, the chance of heart attack or heart disease in women increase to become similar to the chance in, in men. Really? That, that substantially? That that's, quickly? Okay. That, and that's, you know, that's the protection that they get from estrogen. That, that being said, um, young women who have risk factors like diabetes or high blood pressure, they tend to do worse if they do if they have a they have higher chance of heart attack than a male who has those risk factors even if they're young and if they end up with a heart attack they do worse they have a higher chance of dying women are smaller they have smaller um, arteries but um, it's extremely important for women who have risk factors to work on them and that's how they're going to prevent heart attacks no smoking mm -hmm. exercise weight loss and uh, controlling blood pressure, high cholesterol, and definitely diabetes. Well, Dr. George Hosh, thank you so much for shedding some of the light on this. I know it's heart month for February, so trying to pay a little bit more attention to, to, to this as well. And uh, thanks again. For